Hey guys, Shane Storms with DroidMotorX.com. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Viper ROM for the HTC One. This is by Team Venom, and this ROM is all about customization. Now this is a Sense 5 ROM. Uh, the great thing about it is it has the Aroma Installer, and you can choose to have as much HTC Sense on it. You can have as much HTC Sense taken away from the ROM as you like. So it doesn't have to be completely flooded with bloatware. You can have all that stuff removed when you install it. I'll include a link on how to install this ROM in the link in the description. Uh, but really, today we're just going to talk about how the ROM functions. So you guys can see that it runs very fast. It does have the blink feed there as well. And it just tends to really fly. Everything is speedy, everything is fast. We go into settings and about software information. You'll see that we're running the Viper 1 1.2.1. Right now that is the latest version of Viper uh, for the HTC One. It's since 5.0 and Android version 4.2.2. And the coolest thing about this obviously is the Venom tweaks. So if we go into Venom tweaks, you have an information screen and then you have status bar tweaks and there's so many things that you can do here you can hide or reorder the quick settings choose icon size of your quick settings Let's see we'll go into hide and reorder so on your quick settings when you pull down there are your quick settings and you can change the order or take them away all together and then you can also choose uh, the ones that you like if you have no notifications you can choose uh, to have that to open automatically so if I clear out all my customizations I'll show you guys what I'm talking about here that opens up your quick settings automatically you can choose to disable quick settings altogether you have status bar icon themes you can actually download and choose a theme you can choose to put a status bar icon in the status bar you can choose to include the status bar brightness slider you can choose a custom carrier label I normally go with Droid Motor X. Here it is, Viper 1. You have a Sense Themer. You can choose a custom icon pack. You can choose your home screen layout. That just allows you to add more apps to your home screen. Customize your menu. You can make your nav bar transparent and choose transparent folders. You have a clock shortcut, weather shortcut. Transparent nav bar, custom app drawer transparent blink feed and you can choose a blink feed background you can also change the blink feed color and then you have some lock screen settings you can choose the AOSP lock screen and then you have all kinds of AOSP lock screen settings there you can choose a carrier caption custom app notifications from the lock screen quick flashlight from the lock screen allows you to use the power button to turn on the flashlight that's a pretty cool feature and I'll go ahead and enable that use the volume up key to toggle flashlight when screen is turned off volume keys you have volume key music controls and then you have some long press settings long press capacitive button settings short press capacitive button settings and you have a swipe setting there you have some button settings three finger gestures, soft menu bar, capacitive backlight, you can take a picture by pressing the home button, override haptic feedback, volume wake, volume down screen off, there's some more long press settings, double press settings, double press actions, long press actions, short press actions and swipe actions, there are some miscellaneous settings, and some advanced settings, then you have some CPU settings. This is where you can change the settings for your clock. So you can overclock or underclock. You can set a governor and an I.O. schedule. If we go to personalize, you can choose your own wallpaper, lock screen style, you can customize your home screen, your ringtone notification sound, and alarm. You have the Venom Hub. So this is where you can really uh, customize the look and feel of your device. There are all kinds of icon packs that you can install here. So you can see all of the options here, several to choose from. Then you have themes for your status bar, status bar logos, operator logos, backgrounds, fonts, 
And then you have add-ons. Uh, these include full themes. So we have the red Venom theme and the stock Viper theme. Uh, so many different things to choose from here. And then you have some kernels. Several kernels to choose from as well. So as you can see, the Viper ROM is one of the most customizable ROMs for the HTC One. So that about wraps it up for the Venom ROM for the HTC One. If you've enjoyed this ROM, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more coverage of like this on the HTC One and other devices. You can find more of me at DroidModerX.com. I'll have the latest in Android and Tech news. Follow me on Twitter at DroidModerX. Thanks for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.